Turkeys are not hard to raise and brood if you follow a few simple steps. I'm going to show you how to do that in this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any of our videos. Turkeys are pretty easy to raise if you follow a few simple guidelines and are careful with how you brood them and raise them. Let's look at how to set up your brooder well in advance of when your poults arrive. So this is our brooder box and it is probably maybe what, four or five feet by maybe three feet. And this came from my husband's work. It has a, it used to have a cool wooden lid, but I don't need that. So it's, it works perfect for brooding. I love this thing. And I'm gonna use it for turkeys. We will move them in probably a week or two. We just don't have the other garage pens set up yet. So I'm using a 250 watt red bulb. You can find you can find lower wattage ones. I have them. I think they're 75 or maybe 150, but it's still pretty chilly out here, so I want to make sure that it's warm enough. And I have my chain and everything else. This cool hook right on the side of there so you can adjust and hang heat lamp. And I've got a thermometer, so I'm going to check it. You want it to be just like chicks. You want it to be around, you know, 95, 100, but you want to have plenty of room that they can get away from that heat if they need to. So you don't want to cook them out. And it is two days before the turkeys are supposed to come. And I want to make sure I have this ready to go well before the turkeys are rolling into it. And I'm realizing that I have no idea where the heat should be. So I want to check it out now so I'm prepared and have everything ready to put their food and water in. Okay, let's talk about what you're going to feed these little poults when they come. It's important that they get off to a good start. So you're going to want to use a 28% feed for them. Um, you can actually do 24% too. I like to use 28. You can do medicated or not. Just make sure it's specifically for turkeys if you're using the medicated feed. And you're going to keep them on that feed for about the first six weeks of their life. Okay, now your turkey poults are here. One thing about poults is they can be a little hard to get going on food and water. So make sure that they're eating and drinking well. I like to get them to that water, dip their beaks in there. You can put little, those shiny marbles and kind of encourage them to peck at that and get going on their food. So just keep an eye on them and make sure that they're eating and drinking well. Okay, let's talk about when they get bigger. Okay, these are broad-breasted bronze and they grow very, very quickly. Your turkeys are gonna be very friendly and personable if you choose to be so with them. But as they grow, you're gonna to wanna to give them more room. And these are, these have a very big brooder, but you still want heat in their brooder for them. And these guys are completely feathered in and they are about five weeks old now. At this point, after your turkeys are about six weeks, you can start weaning them off the light so that they're ready to go outside. You can also drop their feed down to around a 20% starter, and they can be on that until you're either ready to process them or for the rest of their life if you're keeping them for pets, however you want to do it. They'll be moving outside to their outside coop here in about another week. Before moving them outside, make sure that you have a draft-free area that's well sheltered from the weather and the wind, especially when they're young. I will still have a brooder lamp on them and available when it's getting pretty chilly at night, but I'm starting to acclimate them to maybe not going with a light during the day when it's around 60 or 70. But make sure that as your turkeys grow, they have plenty of room because you do not want them overcrowded. That's how you're going to get into some disease problems. As your turkeys grow, you're going to want to raise the water in the feed so it's about eh, shoulder level to them, if you want to call that shoulders. But these, um, I keep raising as they grow. If you raise broad-breasted turkeys, which are what I'm showing you in this video, they are going to be ready for processing around 16 to 20 weeks if you want a big turkey. You can pretty much process them at any time depending on what size you want. 
Remember that your turkeys are gonna dress out about 15 to 20% less dressed weight than they are live weight. So keep that in mind, you can weigh them and see how they're progressing. But if you're doing broad breasted, you can expect a 18 to 20 pound turkey in around 14 to 16 weeks. Toms are gonna to be more, your hens may be a little bit less, but in that range. Turkeys can be very rewarding to raise. Just be careful of a few things when you're brooding them and raising them, and you shouldn't have any problems. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any of our videos. In the description, I also have a link to a video that I did showing all the different things that we make from turkeys around our house.